how to fix a broken crankcase. When you ride as badly as us, it's easy to break crankcases, but it's easy to fix on the trail. All you need is a tube of steel epoxy. If it's a big hole or crack, cut a piece out of a soda can so you have an alloy sheet to cover the hole. If you want a long-term fix, also carry a small bottle of degreaser to remove any engine oil and a bit of sandpaper to prepare the surface. Steel epoxy is pretty amazing stuff. No, 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 no. Riders have also used this as a temporary fix for radiator leaks and broken gear shift levers, clutch levers, front brake levers. I cracked my crankcase in a rock garden, but being a two-stroke, the small loss of transmission oil wasn't critical. I kept riding it and repaired it the next day. Here is my very rough guide. And here's a broken side case that we prepared earlier. And in preparation, I would add it's handy to have a family pet to laugh at all the mistakes you make. And of course, always wear safety crocs. I'm whispering so I don't wake the dog up. But the first thing we need are things like terps and detergent to clean it all up. So I've got all the oil residue off. I might just sandpaper this a bit just to ensure better adhesion. Now you've got all sorts of different types of products in this one. This is all I could find in the hardware store. Okay, so most of these are a two-part epoxy. I've got to mix this together so it'll start to set. Very small tubes. Look, this is really good shit for putting in your toolkit. Doesn't take up much space and you can do these repairs trackside, guys. Pretty brilliant stuff. There we go, guys. Indistinguishable from the original, like brand new. <laughs> well, maybe not. Oh, I'm going to sand that in an hour's time and we'll see how she comes up. I should point out too, I don't know whether you should really put this stuff on the inside, but there were just, a, there's possibly one or two metal flakes that could come off. And I thought, well, I'll sand this right back and hopefully that stuff wouldn't matter if it does come off. There we go, after one hour, sandpapered her right back. Now for a bit of cheap spray paint. Woohoo! Now for the final touch, a little bit of light sandpapering. And there you have it, good as new. Or, or maybe more like a side cover that's been belted to shit and very badly repaired. I am a hopeless mechanic, so keen to hear your tips. I'll add these as a pinned first comment on YouTube or in the original text on Facebook.